Hello everyone. I thought for our story today we would do a story about these. We don't have these out very often in class, do we? What animal is it? It's a panda. A panda. Here we are. So we're going to read today Panda Big and Panda Small. We've been talking about opposites in our toddler classes this week. Let's read it together. Panda big and panda small do not like the same things at all. Panda big likes to be asleep at the beginning of the day. Panda small is wide awake and wants to go out and play. Is that ringing any bells, guys? Panda Big likes to sit and think at the bottom of the trees. Panda Small is at the top, peeping through the leaves. There she is. Panda Big likes to have her eyes open to watch the insects fly. Panda Small has her, her eyes tight shut when these come dropping by. Panda Big likes to eat in front of the bamboo. Panda Small is there behind playing peekaboo. Panda Big likes to swing slowly on the rope that's long. Panda Small is on the one that's short. I hope she's hanging on. Panda Big likes to stay out of the water, standing in the sun. Panda Small has fallen in. <gasps> and thinks it's such good fun. But when Panda Big and Panda Small are near and far, it makes them rather sad. And then they know there's just one thing that makes them both feel glad. Being together. Now that's better. Oh, we do like a panda, don't we? Panda. Is this panda big? Or panda small? Big and small are opposites. Have a fun day, guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.